go ahead and cut this. We've got people coming over here right now, but uh, we'll have more ceremony later. So we'll have more fun. ceremony. Later. <laughs> tenants and all of you, the business community, and it, this is just a fantastic day. So you'll see homage to Thomas Edison throughout, and of course um, the lineage that we have about. O'Callens did not enthuse about Mr. Edison's incandescent light. table and, and shown that they're willing to support is unbelievable. This started, I know Pete Tesh is out there somewhere, this started kind of on Pete Tesh's whiteboard. And I got to tell you, to have three residents and we're just now opening the door is incredible. Up to the you building know. for 24-7 access. So, Frank Hennessy, here's your official backstage pass representing the Board of County Commissioners. Charlie? Thank you, Gary. for a million dollars. That's going to be a great day. That's all. Under a million dollars. There you go. Lee Niblock, welcome. In the second half, we are going to take that offense uh, to victory, and we don't punt. The facility no. is going to power this community well into the future and growing jobs and opportunities. Power Plant Business Accelerator, Ocala Marion County's Innovative Job Creation Initiative, established February 10, 2012, energizing entrepreneurial excellence with Power Director Kevin Reed. Um, Kevin hit the ground running a little less than a month ago. He's doing a terrific job. He brings energy and expertise. He is a serial entrepreneur in itself. So, I always had this impression of Thomas Edison as this genius. So here he was in 1870 with about $700,000 in his pocket. And three years later, uh, after he had reinvested all of his money back into his business, for him before he had a viable prototype. That's a story that's very relevant today. And we have excited and, and um, I don't know what more we just said here. University oh, partners in particular, my alma mater, China. Yeah. 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 